I blow it, see plex. Your boy, you see net. How that mag and shoddy work. Can't rid this smell with bath and body works. It's sad and probably worse. First, the chroma spit. Wise guys do drive bys and don't own a whip. Time comes, divine sons need a song to rip. Thugs and harmony, cool. I got a phone to pick. Vlogs, battles, music videos, interviews, and much more. Pushing the culture forward. No Mercy TV. Yo, what's good, y'all? No Mercy. Trap New York shit. No Mercy TV.com. I know what time it is, man. We here with the URL Awards. You feel me? Fan vote. URL 2021 Awards, man. So this is basically... um. Just an award thing URL decided to put together, you know, showcasing a lot of the stuff that went on, you know, on their particular platform uh, throughout last year, you know, so I'm, I'm looking at it, you know, want to go through these categories with y'all and just, you know, highlight a couple of things and talk about a couple of these things, man. Uh, make your voice heard, cast your ballot below for all the categories to award all the battlers for all the hard work, all the performances for the calendar year 2021 on the Ultimate Rap League. So you already know. This is their shit. You're not going to see no RBE or KOTD related stuff. This is strictly for, you know, URL and A platform, right? So, um, let's talk about these categories. Um, most Improved Battler 2021. You got Jack Boy. You got Nun Nun. You got Lou Castro, Sirius Jones, and Sue Surf. This is a tough choice. This is a tough choice. And the reason being is because um, the the top ones i would say out of this right would be sirius jones surf and jack boy um lou castro and nun nun to me right they turn around stories ain't really as big as the others you feel me like jack boy you all know the, the john john battle then right after that the franchise battle but when it came down to that tournament um the, the saga battle and you know all these other battles he did last year Jack Boy done really turned it around, man, and he done really got himself back on the fan side. The fans are starting to support everything he got going on, you know, everything with the Midnight Madness, et cetera, et cetera. So Jack Boy actually, you know, did what he was supposed to do in terms of just, you know, doing a complete 180 on his career. Right? Sirius Jones. Um Damn. Yeah, out of these three, I I would knock Sirius Jones um off the list well not not off the list but I, I don't think his was as strong as jack boys and surf you know um jones was always kind of just around like i don't feel like he had a period where it was like okay you're getting body you feel me you have a lot of people that feel like serious jones never lost the battle so if you're just you know um going and just having battles um not losing it's not really that much of a story there you know now in, in terms of being improved yes it seems like Sirius Jones for the last year or so has figured out his lane and you know really turned around in terms of actually showing up and in, with intentions on killing shit but um I just feel like surfing Jack boy man those are the guys that was really like losing getting smoked and then turned it around and are having like, you know, stellar performances and shit like that. So it would really be for me out of Jack Boy and Surf. You feel what I'm saying? So, you know, um, that that would be, you know, however y'all uh, decide to, you know, vote that. Two on two team of the year. Um, yo, I watch so many battles, right? It's hard to even really remember so many performances. But for me, if I had to say a two-on-two team, um, for me, it would it would have to go to who was the most memorable, right? Because looking at all these teams, I don't think any of these teams battled more than once. And that's another thing. I think when you do two-on-two team of the year, you have to kind of, you know, include people that might have battled. But then again, you know, it wasn't that much two-on-two action last year. So it ain't really too much to go off of but if i had to go with the most memorable it would be a toss-up between avin fawns and probably lou and uh sean yeah I, I would say those it would be out of those two 
it'd be out of those two because you get different things from both from Lou Castro and Sean. You get the energy, you get the performance, you get, you know, hey big hey big dog and all that. And then Avin Fawns is just a straight up bar and punch fest, you feel me? So I feel like it would be whoever you prefer out of those two um different, you know, attributes in terms of battle rap, you know, so um those it would probably be one of those. I'm not gonna hold y'all. I voted already, so y'all not gonna see me doing my votes on here. Um I'm trying to be uh how can I say uh, uh, diplomatic about it? <laughs> Not voting for certain shit and then, you know, uh, swaying the votes and stuff like that. So I don't want to um, do my votes on cam, but I'll, I'll leave that up to y'all to really, you know, um, do y'all votes and shit like that. So come on with this. This round of the year list is crazy. This round of the year list is crazy. Um, round of the year for 2021. Loso second versus Vixen. Easy first against Chess. Chess first against Easy. Fawn second against Lou. That was the Paul Bearers line, I believe. Um, Geechee second versus Calico. Danny third versus Drugs. <laughs> T-Top second versus Mike P. Easy first versus Rex. Real six second versus Dan. Like, this is just a whole lot of rounds for no reason, yo. Way too many. But but it, it's a lot to choose from. But they, they could have shortened this to maybe about a good 10 like it's like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 choices bro yo whoever put this together i don't know if it was beasley p chico one of y'all come on man if y'all want Add more categories. Do not be having a million choices for one. Uh, what's the name? Y'all should have went with whatever was like the most, the most memorable. You know, amongst the people. Shorten it. Even if you want to shorten it to like ten, even ten is cool. But thirty choices to choose from is kind of crazy. Like this, damn near every round that happened on URL last year. Jesus. Um. It would this would be this would be tough. This would be tough because don't get it twisted. These are all good rounds. These are all good rounds. Some classic, some, you know, even legendary. I'm not gonna hold y'all. The most memorable to me out of out of all of these. Yo, Twerk first versus Loso was one of them ones, man. Twerk first versus Loso, high contender. Surf first versus John John definitely one of them ones, especially with um you know John John having as weak of a first as he did, um, Jack Boy third versus Oops was retarded, man. Um, Coffee first versus T Top was crazy. Like this, this is a lot of good rounds. This is a lot of good rounds. But um, I don't know. I, I might go with that Turk um Turks first versus Loso. I might go with that one, man. I think I think I might go with that one, but y'all 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 let me know in the comments, man. What what what's it looking like for y'all? You feel me in the comments? Um, put put each of these categories and let me know what what y'all had, you know, in terms of um shit, in terms of all of these uh these joints. But that's that's a lot of rounds. Y'all wilding for that? That's thirty something rounds. Like, come on, you feel me? Rebuttal of the year for twenty twenty one. Uh, Chilla versus Sean. Oh, the the wire. I think was was that the wire, uh, rebuttal. If I'm not mistaken, I I think it was. I think it was the wire rebuttal. Um, Danny rebuttal versus Shug. I remember he rebuttal versus Shug. I don't remember what it was. Turbo rebuttal versus Loso. None none rebuttal versus Quest McCody. Yeah, I would go with the chiller one. I would go with the chiller one. That that's just me. I would go with the chiller one because that that for me was the most memorable. That was the most memorable and the most well executed in my personal opinion. Like that shit was was perfect. Like <clears throat> it don't get no more perfect than that. So I will go with that. Rookie of the year. Real name Brandon. MVP, Kid Slay, Prestavia, Sheed Happens, Royalty, Anderson Burris. Now here's the thing. More than half this list gets knocked off. And I'm gonna tell you why. Real name Brandon and MVP made it to Summer Madness. That right there is an accomplishment in itself because everybody ain't allowed on Summer Madness. So 
aside from that, you Prestavia might be close just because she had, you know, one of the biggest buzzes. But if you're talking solely URL, making it to Summer Madness for me is the, the make or break here. Like, um, we didn't see enough from Anderson Burris. Didn't see enough from Royalty. And Royalty is fire. Royalty is fire. He's slowly becoming one of my personal favorites in terms of, you know, the newer guys. Um, she Happens is fire. Kiss Late is fire. All of these people are fire. But if we had to rank them, and, and especially being that uh, Brandon won, yeah, I would give it to him. I would have a uh, real name Brandon uh, Rookie of the Year. You feel me? Um, salute to everybody else. But that that's some madness. That makes it a clear cut uh thing for me. So let's let's uh see these other ones. Performance of the year. Surf versus John John, Twerk versus Tay Rock, Jazz versus Gaddis, Rock versus Twerk, Chess versus Easy, Easy versus Chess, Jack versus T Top, T Top versus Mike P, Geechee versus Case, Rum Nitty, uh versus Geechee. Um, Lou and Sean, Easy and Rex. Uh, see, here's the thing. There's a lot of these performances that are good based off of one round or maybe two rounds. If I had to go with of the year, hmm, this is a tough one. This is a tough one. Now, Chess and Easy both, man, it would be out, it would be out of them two. It would be out of chess and easy. Them, them niggas had battle with the year, bro. Them niggas had battle with the year. Some of the best rounds, like the best absolute six rounds you've seen in a rap battle in a long time, go to chess and easy. So it would be it would be up it would be out of one of them. It would be out of one of them. Um who I would pick out of the two, probably easy. Probably easy, and that's just because I, I got so much support for Easy and what he's doing right now. Like, he's easy one of the he's easily one of the front runners. Um, just in terms of like you know one of the best battlers of the, of the past year, so he he's definitely um close to you know I, I would have to have him as the best choice. That's just me. So let me let me know what y'all think, man. Face off of the year, stumbling bowls, Rex was easy. Sheed and Trufo, DNA and King Los, J2 and Trufo, Surf and Calico, Shuni and Vixen, 40 Bars with Casey J, Mook and Reed, Easy and Chess, Hollow and Rum, Surf and John John, Swerve versus Stumbles, Easy versus K-Shine. Damn. Which one of these face? You know what's crazy? I didn't get a chance to watch a lot of the face-offs. Um this year just because i didn't really have time to catch um most of these I, I would still have to go back and watch a bunch of them but uh in terms of a face-off man uh rex and easy might be the one for me yeah rex and easy might be the one for me i don't know how surfing john john was up is up here when john john wasn't even saying shit like that no way in hell was that face off of the year you know what i mean for me to be for it to be face off of the year it had to be both parties going crazy, talking they shit. You know, if you want to look at um, Rex's face-offs, right? Like Rex versus Bill, Rex versus Reed. I, I, ironically, I watched those both, you know, um, a couple of days ago. Those are the type of face-offs where it's like both people wilding. That's, to me, is what makes a contender for face-off of the year. You know, so, um, yeah, I might, I might go with Rex versus Easy, and that, that's one of the ones I happen to see. Um... DNA and King Los was a good one too You know what I mean So it, it would be out of those two But mo for me most likely Rex was easy Best promo of the year Anderson Burris Easy Win Wins this without um, It ain't even a question for me um, Aver promo from his hustle Jazz promo for Gaddis Easy vs Rex uh, Lady Caution vs Yoshi Sheet happens Surf vs Nah e Easily Anderson Burris Anderson Burris has some of the best promo videos You know in battle rap So Easily, he he gets that. He gets that. He 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 definitely gets that in my opinion. Um, battle of the year, easy versus chess. Ain't nothing else to talk about. The, the rest of these are great battles. Rock and twerk. Um, the two on two, Lou and Sean versus Avin Fonz. Easy versus Rex was was a great battle in my opinion. Um, so was easy versus T Top. But battle of the year, easy versus chess. So not even the contest. You know, the rest of these are good battles, but of the year. 
Easy versus Chess. Male Battler of the Year. My personal opinion, easy to block Captain. Um, Surf had a good year. Rock Rock had a good year this year, actually. A good 2021. His 2021 was fire. Um, Chess had a good uh, had a good 2021. Real Sick had a great 2021. Great 2021. Um, Geechee did as well. Geechee did as well. Bunch of great battles, bunch of great performances. But I would have to go with Easy to Block Captain. You feel me? Female Bachelor of the Year. Coffee, Yoshi, 40, Vixen, Casey, Gaddis, First Lady Flames, Jazz the Rapper. Yo, how is Miss Hustle not up here with that super body she caught on Averb? Like, I don't get it. For me personally, it would be Yoshi. It'd be Yoshi. Um, I felt like Yoshi had, you know, not only some of the best content, but um, some of the biggest moments. You feel me? Out of all the females. Uh, Coffee definitely made her mark. She she did a whole bunch of dope shit last year as well. So it, it'll probably be between them two. It'll be between them two. Um, it, it's, listen, man, it would be hard to put Gaddis one because she didn't, it's not like she had a lot of battles, but also she got smoked by jazz so that would be you know what no i'm gonna give it the first lady flames i'm gonna give it the flames i'm gonna give it the first lady flames for for 2021 female battle of the year first lady flames um consistency consistency that's all that matters man um showing up every time no chokes stumbles etc a1 content like yeah first lady flames got that in my opinion a lot of people gonna be mad with that jazz shit and jazz only had one battle last year Shout out to Jazz, but yo, if you pick Jazz, you are a true epitome of what a stand is. Moment of the year. Uh, T-Top and Anson Burris, Stumble's calling his mom, in front of Jay Black, in front of Smack White, Diamond Tester, tag, tag me. Tag me, tag me. That, yeah, that for me is it. That for me is it. The rest of these are dope moments, though. The rest of these are dope moments. The rest of these are dope moments. Um, Damn. I gotta pull up because um I can't scroll no more for the rest of these. But uh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay. T Rex, my lion Beasley, Jack Boy, Bible Blunt, Real Sick Farmers Protest Awareness, Body Bitch by Tay Rock. Yeah, I I will go with uh tag me. That that's easily the, the the best moment for me. So, you know um jump in the comments. Let me know. What y'all picks off for these URL awards, and I'll holla at y'all soon, man. No mercy. Trap New York shit. Mercy TV.com. I'm out of here.